riding high on a five-bout winning streak, former one-featherweight world champion Hinario The Rock Benario appears inches away from securing a world title shot in the stacked lightweight division of one championship. At 1, Beyond the Horizon on September 8 in Shanghai, China, Benario will look to record his sixth consecutive victory when he faces top Singaporean lightweight contender Amir Khan in the co-main event. A win for Benario will definitely push the Team Lake lightweight contender into the one lightweight world championship picture. If I win this fight, and in decisive fashion, it will already be my sixth straight win," Benario stated. If I can leave Shanghai with my hands raised in victory, then yes, I believe it puts me another step closer to a world championship opportunity. Currently, one championship 77.1 kg division is one of the deepest, with a roster of contenders hungry to get their hands on two division title holder Martin Guyan. Two of those contenders, former one lightweight world champion and Japanese mixed martial arts legend Shinya Aoki and former one lightweight world championship contender Ev Ting, have already been booked in a title eliminator match at One Kingdom of Heroes in Bangkok, Thailand on October 6 to determine who gets a world title opportunity in 2019. With the possibility of clinching his sixth win in a row, Benario could position himself as next in line for a crack at gold, but the same goes for his team Lake teammate and former one lightweight world champion Edward Falayang. Back when Falayang ruled the lightweight kingdom from 2016 to 2017, Benario was already making his way up the ranks. When presented with the idea of a potential showdown against Falayang for the world title came up, the Mankayan, Benguet native had quickly shot it down. That question keeps coming up. Why would I go up against someone who I consider to be my family? We already test each other all the time during practice. I believe there's no need for us to go against each other inside the ring or the cage, Benario clarified. Today, Benario's stance has not budged, not even a bit. With Benario's streak and Fale Yang's own two match winning role, the two team Lake lightweight stars are projected for another shot at the one lightweight world championship. A contest between two of the Philippines' top mixed martial arts heroes is definitely something that fans would love to see, but for Benario, being on opposite ends of the battlefield is non negotiable. If one championship says that I will have to face Edward, I still wouldn't fight him," he said. I looked up to him and respect him a lot. He's one of my teammates and he has helped me a lot to get to where I am today. I would not be here without his help and his guidance. In Bonario's unwillingness to compete against Falayang. He once again echoed just how close-knit things are at Team Lackey. I won't fight him. We are brothers, and I know that we will each have our own time with the one lightweight world championship.